Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Trillium Tarot. This is Stephanie, as always. And this time I'm not showing you a deck of cards. I'm showing you a set of Oyam runes. I believe it's how it's pronounced. Uh, there are multiple books available about this specific type of rune. Uh, this is just the first book I could grab, uh, put my hands on. I think I have a couple of more, but they might be in the basement. Uh, this type of rune is spelled O-G-H-A-M. And I believe it is pronounced Oyam, uh, but who knows? It's Celtic. I'm probably slaughtering it. But anyway, just so you know, that's where it comes from. And this is a type of uh, rune that the Druids used. Now, I was able to find a set of runes that are um, in English, etched in English on the, uh, the, the runes themselves. And I'm quickly trying to flip through this book and see if I can find a sheet or an explanation of what these originally were. Because originally these were, here we go. All right. So in this book, originally these runes were just a set of lines etched on the stick or the, the rock or whatever the medium was. And so you can see that it depends on if the, the one through five lines are on the left side or on the right side or at an angle and so on. So this was the original way these runes were created. Uh, you can also find them, like you can find little segments of, of the, the woods like my set of runes are here, but they would show the Celtic name of the wood. So it would be the Celtic name for birch or the Celtic name for pine. I selected the, the set where it is etched in English just because that's the way my brain works. So the interesting part of, of this specific set is that each of these segments of wood are the type of wood that's represented. So this is from an apple tree. This is from an oak tree and so on. Now, some of these are not actually trees, uh, like bramble is a type of shrub. Um, Reed is obviously a type of, it's a, it's a reed. It's not an actual wood tree, but these are going to be interesting to learn how to work with and cast and what the magical properties of the, the tree or uh, plant material <laughs> in the example of reed and bramble are, um, and just how to interpret them, whether they were used for divination or applying to my inner life or exactly what that, um, all entails. Now I will put a link to um, the shop. Actually, it's two shops in the description of this video. One of them, the original is based in the UK and they created a sister shop here in the US. I believe it's in Massachusetts. The items are created. I think all of them actually are created in the UK and then shipped in batches over to the sister store uh, in Massachusetts. Uh, shipping is obviously a lot faster from the Massachusetts store than it is from the UK store, but it is really nice to know that these are all handmade, very unique, um, and original to the, the country or the region where the Druids actually lived and worked and worshipped and so on. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do give it a thumbs up since it does help the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. Uh, I'm thankful that you took the time to watch the video and I look forward to the next one. So I'll see you then.